Hey guys, this is Victor again, and today I want to point out another scam or another review. And um, I'm going to compare another Super Green product. This product that you're looking at right here, Super Green Juice, is definitely not a scam. And let me show you why. Um, and I, I just recently put out another video about Touchstone. But if we go and we look at the ingredients list on this product, you're going to see you know, 10 grams in a scoop. You're going to go through here, you're going to total up, and you've got 10 grams of 100% organic ingredients. Everything listed here is organic, and there are no discrete components, meaning there are no vitamins and minerals that have been heavily processed and then added into this. It's just food, and it's organic food that's processed very gently. The other thing is, you can go on to this shop and look at any of their products. They do have other products that I never talk about, but everything is organic, so there's no bait and switch going on. Now, now let's compare this to a product sold on Amazon and elsewhere that looks almost identical. Okay, so here we have Super Greens from this uh, Country Farms. Looks like the same thing. Maybe it even looks better. Wow, they have 50 organic, organic superfoods. Now, I want to show you something. Let's look at the ingredients list. Notice 15 grams in a scoop, okay? Now, by, by the way, this is much, much cheaper, but not really. It's actually for 20 days instead of 30 days compared to the other one. But the big, the big thing I want to show you is when we look closely at this and you see... 15 grams per scoop, when you total up the what's supposedly organic superfood blend, you actually get 10 grams. What is the other five grams? So 33% of this is other ingredients. And the top one, and this is kind of comical for me, they say organic tapioca maltodextrin. What is maltodextrin? It's actually sugar. This is not something you want. So 33% of this product are fillers that you don't want to put in your body. So listen, here's, here's a Wikipedia page, and, and, and not that I recommend using Wikipedia to get honest information, but look at maltodextrin and then look at how it's used, okay? So I'll give you a moment to read how it is used it's a filler, and it's used for, to improve mouth texture, and it's used in potato chips, things like that. It's even used as an insecticide. So it's not something you want in your food. And so once again, um, you know, we have a product that looks amazing, and it is really sad because it is not amazing at all, and I wouldn't want to put this in my body. And not only that, with the deception I see happening here and how you're labeling fillers, I mean, the, all of these things are very heavily processed. So you don't, you don't want to heavily process things in your body. That means the same thing here when they say organic. Really? How organic is it? What are you doing to this food? How is it really being grown? How is it being harvested? How is it being processed? You don't want stuff like that. That is not good. Now, I want to also show you something else. Here, their super greens are labeled as organic. If we go to their store, right, this Country Farms store, and I visit the store, I'm now looking at their, you've probably seen advertisements, they really push this a lot. So they have capsules because people love to take pills. Look closely there is no organic label here at all. They talk about gluten-free and vegan, and they list all these things. Go take a closer look. Nothing here is organic. None of it is organic, okay? It's just fruits and vegetables. Who knows where they come from? Again, the quality of them, no idea. And again, so here's their marketing. They list all of this vegan, non-GMO, I, I don't know, but there's, they're not organic. So what's going on with this company that they supposedly are giving you an organic powder and then when it comes to capsules, 
they are not giving you organic. So once again, we see how bait and switch things are used, how companies fill their products with fillers. Um, and by the way, they will also advertise that this has like no sugar in it. Um, there is somewhere here I had seen, maybe it was in a video. Yeah, there you go, one gram of sugar uh, compared to like a fruit juice, which is five grams of sugar. But this is very, very misleading marketing. So again, I would not use this or recommend this to anybody. It's not about cost. What is your body worth? Put the money into food so you don't have to put it into other things. Again, when we go look at the super green juice from Touchstone, we look at this product, everything is organic. And every food item on their site is organic. Everything is certified. If it's food, it's certified organic. There are no fillers in any of their products. So you got to stick with companies you trust, people you trust. Um, and that's about it for now. So I hope that helps you. If you have more questions about this product or other types of green juice, let me know. Okay? Thank you for watching.